Excuse me, little dog. Hi, guys. <laughs> well, you wondered how long it would fucking take. I'm sure you guys have been wondering how long it would take, and why does it not surprise me that it's on this beautiful full moon night here in the end times in my uh, converted tool shed up here at, uh, at Bugs in a Jar Farm behind my little shack on the side of the road here on the full moon. I think it's full moon tonight. Uh, that would be, what is it, Tuesday night, May 21st, 2024, somewhere in there. So, uh, it was pretty much three months ago tonight that uh, <laughs> I had my last meeting with the Mushroom God. With the Mushroom God, uh, we all know why, I got together with the Mushroom God it was to eviscerate, eviscerate this uh, little uh, succubus that has been eating my brain and uh, sucking my energy, if nothing else, uh, for the last four and a half years. We are, of course, talking about uh, the one and only Dulcinea and... Uh, <laughs> So the Mushroom God finally slammed me upside my fucking head, more importantly, my heart, with a fucking two-by-four and said, get rid of her, Hambone. Get her the fuck out of your life. And did an amazingly good job. And, and for, I think, is it the second or third time I blocked every single avenue that that woman had to uh, to to reach me. I, I blocked uh, every email address. Uh, I blocked every fucking phone number. I kicked her off Humpty Dumpty Tribe. I kicked her off Collapse Chronicles. I uh, I deleted every single goddamn uh, video uh, that that I had that she ever made. I I deleted uh, every peep of her voice, and uh, I finally deleted that photo uh, that uh, you know kept me clinging. To this uh, ridiculous, <laughs> this ridiculous <laughs> that, that 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 I was gonna find uh, my that this woman uh, what was gonna be my doomer chick forever. This married woman who uh, you know lives in a very nice home uh, in in some upscale. Tony suburb of Pittsburgh. She's got her beautiful home. Uh, I, I'm sure she's got a nice car. Uh, she probably uh, wears nice clothes. Uh, she eats good food. She doesn't have to fucking work a day in her fucking life because she's married this dude. Uh, you, you know her fucking her, her fucking meal ticket. Uh, she, she's got it fucking made. Uh, the, the dude, uh, you know, pays her fucking rent. Uh, he's her fucking meal ticket. Uh, she never has to work a fucking day in her life. She's, uh, and, and, and she just, you know, living off, uh, of this dude. And, and I don't think 
uh, that she's in love with this man. I don't think she was ever in love with this man. Never met the guy. I've seen a fucking uh, picture of him a couple of times in, in, in a couple of videos. And, and I'm looking at the dude, and he's probably a pretty nice guy. But, but I, you know, I'm looking at the dude and, and going, what the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, does this fucker have that I don't have? Well, I'll tell you what he has. Uh, he probably has about a $200,000 a year income is, is what the fucker has. He, he has a beautiful home, uh, you know, a good career, uh, plenty of fucking money, uh, and, and he can support this woman, uh, th th this crazy fucking woman. Uh, you know, I, I, I've got nothing but pity for the guy. I, I don't know if she fucks this guy or not. Uh, I, I, I have no idea. She tells me she doesn't. Uh, she doesn't even need to fuck the dude. You know, she doesn't even have to be a fucking whore. And, and, and uh, he, he just shells out the goddamn money that I don't have to shell out for uh, because I quit my fucking uh, six-figure income. I sold my beautiful fucking home. So, uh, uh, you know, I, I, I can't afford this crazy woman uh, in, in, in my life. She made her fucking choice uh, that, that she is going to give up uh, her, her goddamn passion or, or whatever and, and, and take fucking easy street. Uh, like any fucking woman with a goddamn brain would. I never said the woman is stupid. Uh, Dulcinea is a lot of things. She's batshit fucking crazy. Uh, she, she's goddamn borderline personality bordering right on fucking schizophrenia, but she's not fucking stupid. Well, with everything else that woman is, she ain't fucking stupid. There's no fucking way uh, that, that, that she's going to walk away from that beautiful fucking home and that comfortable little entitled life she lives, uh, you know, with this fucking clueless moron uh, that she's married to supporting her fucking ass because she doesn't want to fucking work a day in her fucking life. I don't fucking blame her sitting here busting my fucking ass. To make thirty thousand fucking dollars a year, uh, you know. So anyway, uh, four and a half years uh, of my fucking life that I wasted on this woman, uh, thinking uh, with this ridiculous fucking fantasy uh, that that she was gonna leave. Uh, the, 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 this goddamn uh, lion eyes uh, life that she that that she leads. She's lying to her fucking self. She's lying to her fucking husband. She's lying, I guess, to her goddamn friends. You ain't you you're you're, you're you're not fooling me, Maggie. Not for a fucking minute. You're a fucking chicken shit. Is what you are, girl. Nothing more, nothing less. You're a fucking chicken shit. You fucking sold out and you fucking know it. You don't have the fucking balls it takes to be my fucking doomer chick forever. So anyway, uh, I, I finally get the, the goddamn mushroom god to fucking explain all this to me three fucking months ago. On the, is it only been three months uh, so I, I, I get this woman out of my fucking life. I, I, I can actually make it now. I can actually go for the first time in four and a half years. I might be able to make it 72 hours uh, w w without thinking about this woman. Although I've actually, uh, Maggie, I've actually been thinking about you, darling, uh, several times in the last fucking couple of weeks when I'm sitting here busting my fucking ass 
uh, trying to get this place ready, th thinking, you know, what the fuck? Uh, well, what would I be doing right now if, if, if I had to be dealing uh, with that crazy fucking psycho with, with all of the, 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 this fucking work I have to do? Well, would, uh, you know, I'm looking, I, I, I'm thinking, would Maggie be lifting one fucking finger around here to fucking help me uh, g get this place ready uh, for the summer? I know goddamn well she wouldn't. No fucking way that she or any other fucking woman on the planet. I'm, I'm not picking on Dulcinea. Uh, there's not a fucking woman on the fucking planet uh, who, who, would, who would be fucking dealing with this. And I'm thinking, thank the fucking Lord uh, that that woman isn't up here uh, with, with all the shit that I'm fucking dealing with. Uh, the goddamn septic system going down the fucking toilet, building this fucking porch with these fucking Amish people. Uh, good fucking God. Trying to get this place ready to open in three days. And, and uh, so here it is. The, the, the goddamn full moon. This beautiful full moon. Uh, rising over bugs in a jar farm. So I'm sitting down there tonight after busting my fucking ass ten fucking hours today. Sit there, pour myself a goddamn margarita, sit back on my goddamn porch to watch the goddamn full moon rise. So this beautiful full moon uh, rising up over the mountain, and I'm, uh, you, you know, uh, just sitting there alone with, with my fucking thumb up my ass, uh, thinking how, uh, you know, you know, it'd be really nice to have a fucking woman, uh, sitting next to me, uh, uh, ha having, you know, enjoying a goddamn margarita, sitting here watching this beautiful full moon rising, uh, the frogs croaking out in the pond, uh, blah, 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 uh, with the, 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 this fucking, uh, fantasy that I'm, that I'm ever gonna, gonna find a goddamn woman uh, you know, to be beside me enjoying a goddamn full moon rise. Uh, it, 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 it ain't gonna fucking happen. And, uh, I, I go on my goddamn email. Uh, on my email, uh, you know, I, how many fucking email addresses ha have I blocked this, uh, have I blocked Maggie from? Uh, you, you, you know, I, I have, I, I went through every motherfucking way that that woman could get through to me. And I see, from, I have a message from PayPal. From PayPal, you've got money. <laughs> which, 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 you know, I love that. You've got money. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, I, I've got five thousand fucking dollars uh, going out my fucking hands uh, in, in, in the three weeks since I've been here. Uh, yeah, I've, I've got money going down the fucking toilet, and I'm and I'm thinking, who the hell it, it, it is sending me money? You, you know, at my collapse chronicles at gmail dot com uh, email address, where Maggie can't send me a fucking email because she's blocked so so i go on and like who the fuck is sending me money and, and it's got to have dulcinea you fucking dulcinea sending me seventy dollars she she sends me fucking seventy dollars uh, you, you know of her husband's money uh because sure as shit ain't her money so she she uh, she sends me seventy fucking dollars uh, uh, of her husband's money, and uh, what what is what does she say? Uh, her uh, I, I I think her her message was slush fund with some little some little heart emoji next to the word slush fund. 
uh, you know, and, and I'm thinking, and I'm looking at this shit, and, 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 and thinking, you little bitch, you little bitch, sending me 70 fucking dollars, you ruined my fucking life, four and a half fucking years of my life wasted on you, Maggie. And you're sending me fucking seventy dollars with with a little with a little heart uh, next to it, and, and uh, I, I go on there on fucking PayPal, and you have an option on PayPal to refuse the money, and and and, and uh, I, I'm sitting there with my finger hovering over, uh, send this fucking money back. And and, 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 and and block this person for ever send me a, a, a fucking slush fund uh, money and, 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 and you know and I'm and I'm sitting there in that goddamn song uh, Taxi by Harry Chapin. Do you guys remember? Uh, I'm, I'm sure I'm dating myself. I'm sure Maggie. Uh, she's 53, so uh, Maggie is, I, I'm sure, has never heard the the fucking song. Is somewhere back in the 1970s. Um, Harry Chapin, uh, that song "Taxi," starts uh, rolling. I, I hadn't heard that. I, I hadn't heard that fucking song in 30 years. Harry Chapin's "Taxi." You know where the where where the dude is uh, driving his goddamn taxi uh, w w with his fucked up uh, empty little life uh, driving around his in his fucking taxi with with, with his fucking um, thumb up his ass uh, trying to make a fucking dollar bill and, and his puny little miserable loveless life. And, and uh, this woman flags him down, and you know the story. Uh, and 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 she gets in the in the car, and, uh, and and of course, who it is uh, is this woman that he used to uh, that that he used to be in love with. And uh, you know they were making all of these romantic plans together. You know she was off to be a uh, she was going to be an actress like, like Maggie uh, used to be an actress in the goddamn theater troupe in in, uh, in, in Pittsburgh. You know she was going to be a fucking actress, and, and he was going to learn to fly. And, and, and be a fucking pilot, well, uh, it never happened for him. He ended up in his fucking taxi riding around getting fucking high, getting fucking stoned uh, in, in his goddamn taxi. She goes off, uh, you know, trying to make her way uh, to being an actress. And, and, of course, what she does is just ending up, uh, you, you, you know, trading in all of her passion, trading in all of her dreams uh, by, by marrying uh, some fucking dude uh, that she wasn't in love with. She had no fucking business marrying the guy, but she fucking sold out. Just like you did, Maggie. You fucking sold out. Just like the woman in that song. You, 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 you let all your fucking passion, all your fucking dreams uh, go down uh, the, the, the fucking toilet and, and he made this trade-off uh, to trade that in uh, for, for your nice beautiful home in the suburbs and your nice car. Don't have to worry about your fucking grocery bill. Don't I uh, talking about your fucking dental plan. Uh, off of your goddamn husband's insurance and shit, just like the woman in the in, in the fucking song, and, and so they're there, you know, and he, and he's letting her off uh, in, in the driveway, and, and you know, in front of her nice, comfortable uh, home, and uh, remember, this was in the in, in the nineteen seventies. And, and, and she pulls out a fucking $20 bill. 
she pulls out a fucking twenty dollar bill for a two dollar and fifty cent taxi fare, which which was really was a taxi fare back in the nineteen seventies. So she gives them a seventeen dollar and fifty cent tip on a two fifty fare, and and I uh, hands them the and hands them this fucking twenty dollar bill, which of course came from her husband. It was her fucking husband's uh, twenty dollar bill, and, and 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 he takes the fucking money, and he's holding the fucking twenty dollar bill, and and, and uh, thinking you fucking bitch. You fucking bitch. You sellout. You chicken shit. And and, and, and sitting here uh, try, trying to get over your, your fucking guilt and your shame uh, by, by handing me uh, the, 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 this fucking money. Uh, you know... Um, and uh, what's the line in the song? Another man would have been angry. Another man would have been hurt. But another man never would have let her go. I stashed the bill in my shirt. So yeah, Maggie, I'm keeping your fucking seventy dollars. I, I, I'm gonna go try to find some fucking hooker. Uh, it'll give me a fucking blowjob uh, for seventy fucking dollars. I wonder if you can still buy a fucking blowjob in this town for for seventy fucking dollars for the four and a half years worth of blowjobs uh, I, I, I I fucking gave up because of you. You know, it's, 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 it's fucking insulting, but uh, my 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 little ego, uh, I'll fucking get over it, and, and I'll take your fucking husband seventy dollars, and probably end up buying me a couple of bottles of tequila. I'm fucking believable. Uh, that that this woman ha has found this little crack. Oh, God. Another man would have been angry. Another man would have been hurt. Another man never would have let her go. I stashed the bill in my shirt. All right, little dog, we're heading up to Seahorse. We're going to go up to the top of the mountain for our first night in Seahorse. We're going to go watch the beautiful full moon through the pines. We're going to go up there in our little pine grove, me and my little dog, and, and, and sit there and watch this beautiful full moon filtering through the pines, listening to the frogs, listening to the owls hooting and the foxes barking, and, uh, and get up tomorrow to this chorus of bird song uh, and, and this, you know, this little fantasy land. We're going we're, to we're, we're gonna walk up that, remember that path, Maggie? That you uh, that you did that watercolor of that path through the woods on the very day I, I was building that path uh, up to Seahorse uh, that I'm getting ready to walk by myself and and and, and I was looking at that that uh, that painting you did uh, 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 that damn path thinking it was the fucking universe, talking about uh, how obviously uh, that we are on the same path. You ain't on the same path as me, girl. You're, you're sitting there fucking uh, in, in your nice, comfortable home, painting your little fucking watercolors. I, I'm out there busting my ass, building a fucking path up there. And I'm going to go walk that path beautiful path that, that I built, uh, hoping that you were going to be walking that path with me. I'm going to be walking my path with my little dog. 
and my little dog. I'll sit there and howl at the moon while I still can. Are you ready to go howl at the moon with the owls and the foxes and the frogs? So, it's about, that's a long way up there. I think I just want to sleep right here in this tiny house. Well, we got to go up to the top of the hill like that. It's a long walk, I know that. But you and I are on the same path. You're the one who picked me out of uh, the pound in St. Croix, you remember? You picked me out, little dog. I did not pick you out. I was not uh, going to get you. You picked me out of the pound. Don't forget how this went down. So you're stuck with me. Because you picked me. And we're going to head up that path together and go have a beautiful evening. Uh, just me and my little soulmate. Well, we still can. Bye, guys.